everybody. We are up here on top of the boat, welding our little our little loops on. See here we got our little carabiners. We're gonna weld one here, probably coming out straight out this way here. And then we got the one on the front. We're gonna need to want to put one on this wing. Same thing, kind of going out maybe. We'll see how we do that. Each one is gonna be its own unique thing because it's gotta fit this carabiner that we have in here. If it doesn't fit that, then we're not in, we're not doing good. So we got to do that. So <laughs> problem is we got some wind blowing, and the wind blows the argon gas. The argon gas helps. It'll make a, a, a clean TIG weld. Here comes the master. He's the master. Okay. You need uh, you need something bigger? I've got my hat. Oh, yeah. Do you want my hat? All right. We have tarpaulin on the ground here. We can cut some. Okay. So we're trying to do this in the wind. So we are going to knock this out, weld it all up, and we'll be back with more. So my paradise on Italian Island. Paradise out. All right, Boom. everybody. We got a couple of these done. It's a little bit hot. This one, that, that one's done? Yeah. Okay, now this one? Okay. I got to get up there and put a clip in there. So I'll be back with more. Bye for now. All right. Paradise out. We are now holding the clip on the, on the wing. We got the cardboard there to stop the wind from blowing the argon gas away so he can make a good weld. Yeah. That argon gas keeps uh, splatter and stuff. If you don't, if, if your argon isn't there, it encircles the uh, the weld with argon gas, which doesn't burn. Oxygen burns and pops and sparks. So that's why you want to uh, keep the wind as full of oxygen out of the weld, out of your plasma arc. Okay, so. We're doing that and we'll be back with more. We got the front wings and point done. And we're uh, letting it cool down. We need that board up there to let it cool down some. So it don't melt the tarpaulin because that's all that metal is hot after welding. Bye for now, everybody. Paradise out. Welders are hard at work. We're working on this side. We got the front done here. We got all of that side down to the back. Not the center back but the side back we got this one done we're going this one then that one then the back and then we got them all pretty sure and then we got a we also got a underneath there the trusses the two trusses where the the center line uh three fourths inch box stainless sits we gotta fix those because uh we gotta make them the right width they're a little bit tight and then we'll be uh, good to go so Paradise out. There Bye we go, now. boys and girls. I think we're welding up the last one here. I think we just about got them all. Well, we got one loop to weld up here for the tie straps to go uh -huh. over to that hole. The cable, same steel cable, and the stainless steel cable to go over to this hole. Right here. In that. The camera's all upside down. Right here. And that clips onto here. Oh, well, I take that back. We got one more here. I'm going to put one here, and then we got to put that other one there, so two more. And then I think we're good. Well, and then we got to fix these, these rafters. We got to fix those. That should be pretty quick. We got to take those down to fix those, though. So we will be back with more for my paradise on the Italian Island. Paradise out, everybody. Bye for now. Here's another view from the other side. You can actually see the arc. I know everybody loves that. <laughs> okay, we're done with that one. Now we got to put the loop up here that we tie the tie straps to to each side and to the rear back there where that clip is. And we go from there. So we'll let us do that and we'll be back with more of my paradise on the Italian island. Paradise out. All right, everybody. What we're doing here, this is the roof truss, of course. We never did. Uh, we had to. These were kind of too small of a gap, so we had to cut some, and then we're welding new caps on the sides there so the end's not open. Yeah, so closing up the end like this, like that. So we got to do that on both of these.
trusses. And then we got to finish uh, welding because we just tacked on the center line uh, runners. Well, he already welded this, but we just tacked them. Originally, they were just tacked. This one was welded and uh, polished, so that one was done, but these other ones were just tacked on there, so he's doing a full weld. So, anyway, that's what we're doing now, and we'll be back with more. In my paradise, I'm in Diane Island. Yeah, baby, we almost got this tarpaulin and uh, all the shark fins and everything ready to roll. Paradise. Out. Bye for now. All right, now we're cutting the excess uh, ends off of the, those loops. So some of them are long and they overhang. So we're cutting all those off right now. See right there. See right there where it, it hangs down and hangs hang down. We're cutting those off, the excess. So make it pretty. And then we'll come by and probably buff it real quick. Do a quick buff on it. Yeah, the buffing does good. See, like these welds? That's just a buff right there. Shiny. Shines it up, makes it look decent. So, we are doing the rafters, and we'll be back this morning. Paradise, island. Paradise, everybody. Right now, we're doing the buffing part, buffing the, the whales so that they're shiny, like that. That, that was a stick weld there, and it was all black, but now it's a lot nicer, and all these stick welds are all buffed out, too, so they're looking good. Everything's putting the finishing touches on this work of art. So, we'll be back with more from my product. On the Italian I forgot one what? Just a minute. We think we forgot hey, everybody. one. Everybody, just showing you the finished product here. We got the clips on there, there, there. You get the color of light so the sky don't blind you. We got our tie downs here, these little loops here. Let's zoom that back out. The, the tie downs here to go over to that clip and the tie down. We got the stainless steel cable that goes from there over to there. And from one of those sides, or both of those sides, over to here, at the back of the boat. And this one here. And again, if we need to do any adjustment, we got three holes here where we can pull it this way, this way, whichever ever way. So we got all the corners all clipped down. They're hard to unclip, which is good. But once you get one done, then everything kind of flacks up and then it's easier to get the other two done. But if they're all clipped, that first one's a bit of a bear. These ones here, that one's probably gonna fall down sometimes. I don't know. You may have to just not worry about that one. But if we clip it on the other side, it can't go down and back out. So this one, we just need to clip on that side and it'll pull it over the top. So it is good. And then here's this one here. All nice and clipped. We got all of our slots that this center runner sets in. Got all those done. Our epoxy, by the way, we got we put this on, on here to keep the rain off, but it wound up sticking to it, so we got to sand all this stuff off. There's no big deal. We just sanded it anyway, but it just doesn't look pretty. But that'll get all sanded and smoothed out and painted. We got to paint this whole top part. Redo this whole top, all the tops on these. That one I did, and this one I did, and it's super thick and it looks glassy. It's really nice. Look, it looks like gel coat. In fact, it's so nice. So that's a good thing. These are the things we're cutting off. Are we done, sir? We're good to go. Okay. Done. Well, where's the beer? <laughs> Time for a party. So she's done. We're all hooked and looped and welded and notched and polished and buffed and trimmed and everything. We got it. We got it all. So we are done. Let's see if I can get a picture of this. And, and again, once we get all those tarpons off the boat, it's going to look a lot better. I mean, you'll just see what a boat looks like instead of a boat with a bunch of rags on top of it. But that's basically our tarpon. So we will be back with more My Paradise on the Italian Island.
Paradise out. <laughs>